Welcome back, my name is Mulligan and this is Xenonauts. Yeah, a couple of months uh, went by. I wanted to continue in February, now we have May. But okay, the mods had some time to, uh, yeah, to develop. XNT is discontinued still. And uh, therefore we now have X Division. And we try to, you know, get uh, maybe the end of the game with that mod. I am playing with normal because, yeah, veteran didn't really work out last time. And this time no Iron Man mode. Not because I want to save scum or something like that. I simply want multiple save files for backup because I had twice or three times the problem that my save file was corrupted and I could not continue. So yeah, the, I would say we simply start. Uh, the m links for the game Xenonauts are in the description, Steam and homepage and a link for the mod too, which you can simply download from the official forum of uh, Xenonauts and then you have uh, to download the two or three hot patches for the game in the same thread and you can play it too. So let's begin. We have X Division, which probably has a lot of stuff that I do not understand because all these mods add stuff and I'm not really reading all that much, but we will begin in in, in Africa, like, or here, and there we go. Come on, let's go here. And yeah, why not? Middle East. You know what? Let's call it Mullington. There we go. And we have our first base. Mm, let's see, we have one new plane. Interesting, interesting. Uh, we don't have much... St uh, not uh, more stuff to build. Yeah, first off, medical center, which is still not in the beginning of the game. We have 2.2 million. Let's see what we need before we uh, uh, expand all our resources. We have some research, a bigger screen, like it. We have more. We have some. X for X division. You see, nice touch, nice touch. Uh, we do not have to produce anything. Uh, how many people do we have? We have a lot of people, which is good. Okay. Uh, we do not have anything. We can give them weapons, the normal weapons. Do we have some other tooltips? Yes, we do. Nice, good to know. Uh, I think we have new new icons. Now, this uh, Xenonauts is now running on a new version instead of the uh, old uh, 1.0.9, which XNT run on or ran on. This is the new version of either Xenonauts, so this could be Xenonauts uh, themselves. Uh, stuff adding, adding, could be the mod too, who knows. Now vehicle, and we have two condors and an AVAX, which has two cannons, tower cannons, we could get auto cannons, hmm, I'm not really sure, what is better? I mean, it starts with tower cannons, but this one starts with auto cannons? This seems like a, a surveillance aircraft. Airborne warning and control system. So I would say, let's see, HP, it has a lot more HP. It is slower, but has a bigger range. I have a feeling I can fly over stuff with this to check, like a mobile radar. Good, so I would say, we start with adding some lab uh, laboratory uh, laboratories. God damn it! And 
how many people do we have? We have a lot of people we can get. Hire some more scientists. Ten more. We need all the scientists we can get. Uh, do, 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 do we need some other stuff? A garage. Pretty useful, pretty useful. There we go. And I think that is all. We burned some funds, but not really all that much. Uh, let's simply wait. Uh, let's launch. You know what? Let's launch here our AVAX. Simply to check. And then speed up. Yeah, as you see, mobile radar probably helps for... Oh, we have our first small ship. Let's go and get our condors running. So with the AVAX I can check if... Oh, another small ship. Another small... Holy crap! A little bit fast there. Can we tail until over land? It's... I don't think it is going to. You know what? Uh, engage. Auto resolve. There we go. First UFO shut down. Problem is now my two condors are a little bit damaged and they need to refuel. So I can't really get those ships up. Rearmed and refueled, and the second one is probably. Ah, uh, really? I need to wait. And it is gone. Don't tell me that night vision plays a role here. No, doesn't seem so. Okay, return. Uh, has reached. Doo -doo -doo. Select new target, go down here. Because there are. Some there's something down here, so I can check. He should be able to come in range of the enemy UFO. Was the AVAX is really slow. Now we have some new stuff. Icelandic incident. Interesting. Uh, we can even check AVAX. Airborne warning and control system is our best mobile detection system. A very slow and vulnerable aircraft with huge fuel capacity and radar range. All other countries save these planes themselves. So this one is our only one. Take care of it. Oh. I should probably not let it fly around like that. Here, here we can check auto cannon. Uh, we work can I check the other cannon? Is not checkable. Okay. Uh, we can now research our hunter scout car. Bam. Which we probably need. Oh, we have the UFO. We cannot attack. So our AVAX. Go back. Please don't die. Would be pretty bad if you would die. Uh, go to last known location. We can select a new target with our AVAX. There we go. There we have our small UFO. I don't think we have enough fuel. Okay. So let's patrol. Or not. Oh, s oh, simply patrol is like this. Okay. Select new target. So we can maybe get the UFOs earlier on our radar. So we can launch before they come into our range. Now this game is said to be quite hard. As always. These games are quite hard. Oh, right. Before I forget. We need to build stuff. We need two radar arrays. We do have some money. Bam, bam. So we have the full range of our rain uh, of our radars. So we have uh, more coverage. 
as always needed. Let's fast forward. Select new target. Okay, nothing happening. Research takes a while. I'm simply... Okay, it's low on fuel. I'm simply going around our radar range to hopefully see... There we go. How much uh, if there are some people running around. We have all these scientists that do nothing, so they can simply look into the hunter scout car. Uh, we have some sightings here, so we can launch our AVAX into this general direction. Pretty neat addition, I have to say. Oh, da, da, da. It should help. A faster one would be nice, something that uh, is fast running around. The forest fire. Let's see, do we find something? No alien. So not all messages are aliens. Or alien nature. Good to know. We still need construction of garage complete, so we can get a hunter scout car as soon as we research. Or well, the research finished, uh, there we go. Uh, no new research, but we can finally build. So our research is done. We are going to build one hunter scout car. Takes four days. So we have something that can tank for a while. And it's not that expensive, right? Cost us 60k, not that expensive. Now we have a lot of money. I could probably get a second base up and running, but I don't really I don't really like the second base that early. I would like to fight some aliens, but yeah. The only ship that we shot down was over water. There we go. Go, Condor. Get them, get them. Nice. And destroy. Now, how's our time coming? We had 10 minutes into the game, into the video, so we wait. Crash sign. Okay, we wait until day arrives. Or rolls around. Okay. Now. It's a good old looking at our guys. Now, holy crap, we can have 10 guys in our Charlie? 10? Right. Could, yeah, we can have the money. Uh, we can only have 7, I think, if we get the Hunter Scout car. Forgot about that. Okay, we have an assault. Has a uh, pretty much has okay. We have a sniper. We have another assault. We have a rifleman, heavy weapons, rifle, 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 rifle. We have two assaults. Hmm. Strength, accuracy, time units. You know, I want you to change roll into shield. I like to have a shield guy at the beginning. Let's get some more grenades. Oh, nice. Nice, nice. You can see how much weight they can carry. Exactly. You know what? Let's carry... Can you carry another weapon? You can. We will definitely do that. Because weapons have different uh, damage types. We have only kinetic at the moment. But I mean... If my sheet breaks or the pistol is not enough, I can always change to the to our little shotgun. Our sniper definitely needs another weapon. Um, let, mm, I don't think that. Let's go with that. We don't really need that many grenades. There we go. So. This is something that I learned, more, more or less. You you have a weapon. You, you can keep some grenades on you. Because it is more or less vital. 
No, 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 no. Nothing explosive. I learned my lesson. Maybe another... Yeah, there we go. Because it doesn't really help having only one weapon. It can always happen that you run out of ammunition or you need to change your weapon. Can happen too. Especially in this mod. Different types of aliens have different types of uh, yeah, of weaknesses. L we have four different damage types, if I read correctly. M uh, kinetic, we have... Let's get no another grenade. We have uh, pyro, I think. I, I don't really know which were the specific types, but we have four different types. And aliens have different weaknesses, so we should accommodate for that. You know what? Some riflemen need a little bit more ammunition. There we go. We can always get another metal pack. They are pretty useful. As you see, this mod ha doesn't have producing stuff or the n normal grow uh, level 1 stuff. I think this is quite tedious to do, but okay. Good that it is not in here. Let's go, Charlie. Let's go slowly but surely to this mission. I don't know how long this mission takes, but I think I will keep the same progress we had in the last uh, season. So I... If there's combat, I will show the whole combat in one video, if possible. Okay, naturally I done goofed and did not change where they are. So I have them all over the place. Okay, now... Check. There we go. Another... Oh, we have civilian. Um, not the best enemy. Where's my shield guy? There you are. We have two civilian right off the bat. There we go. Now I don't know what da is down there, which is... This is a really bad spot, all things considered. We have... Mm, we need to check what is down here. I need to have a little more vision. I should be able to get you up here. Nice, okay. I don't know if something is down here. Could kill me. Okay, another one in cover. I need to get my guys in cover. Now, the sniper will stay here. Prob hopefully, he is going to attack someone down here. Uh, this is all I can hope right now. 26, there we go. A little bit more cover. I don't know how many of my guys are going to die. Because aliens are not really all that... Easy to handle. They are pretty deadly. Oh, wow. Okay, they did nothing the whole time, but now they decide to shoot. Interesting, okay. You, you can run over here. So, first off, can we attack? Do we want to attack? We do want to attack. Let's go. A burst is... How big is the chance? 13% and 45% block? Yeah. You know what? Mm, doesn't really give us that much. You should be able... Yeah. 25, 41. Ah, management. How many points do we have? 32, so we can only take one. Let, let's burst. 
five damage. Hallelujah! We are doing a lot of damage. I hope they have like 20 health. If not, I am pretty boned. We do have some grenades. I mean, uh, we do not have some grenades. We do have them, we cannot use them. Uh, you know what? Let's burst. Let's hope he gets under pressure. He comes under pressure. Nope. Doesn't care one bit. And uh, 9. 9. Okay. Another 9%. Okay. You're useless. Now. Do, do we have some stuff here? No, no, no. Let's. Uh, you know what? Let's, let's keep that. Let's keep that. I can always up the sound in post process. So let's check. What is our enemy? Yeah, grenades. Wow. Okay, two of my guys are half dead. Okay. He's missing. Good for me. Still half dead though. Panicked. I love panicking. And panic. They are not bleeding, which is good. Not really. Now, first off, I need my. I need to check what is going on here. If there's something, someone around here. Okay, I checked here. We should check with him. Okay, nothing going on here, which means I can pull those two back. We can even get a nice hit. Let's go with that. Bam, 49%, uh, 49 damage, good, good damage. Let's go, burst. Okay, so they have armor, it seems, because they do take more damage now. Okay, let's try to kill him. We should get it someday. Come on, kill him. Come on. Suppressed. Suppressed is good. There we go. One is dead. One dead. Cost us only two guys at the moment. Now, we could run in here, we should do. Holy crap, I don't know, I don't know who that is. He is red. He is red and he doesn't like me. Hopefully, oh, a ship, entrance. Good, you missed, good job. I love you too. Was nice meeting you. You are probably dead. We run up here. We go into a crouching position. Yeah, let's see. Let's see what he's doing. He's he tries to shoot. Civilian still pretty good at regenerating health. So one thing this mod has is that many of the alien types have different uh, subspecies uh, de depicted by the color. You see red here, green here. This is a normal one. This is a special one or a subspecies. And you have to capture the different one to unlock more research. So technically we should try to get him to fall unconscious, which we can only do if we if we uh, bring enough flashbangs and hit enough times. There we go, one. He gets suppressed and the little blue, the little blue uh, d -d -d number above him is more or less his, his uh, inform what? information panel, no, is his morale. If it goes low enough, he should fall unconscious. 
so we could plan. I don't have enough points for that. What I could do, this is interesting, he can simply get his mat pack out. He could get his mat pack out. There we go. He could change his area because he has no cover there. He has a shield. We are going to throw in another flashbang. Uh, he is still conscious. Can we throw another? No. Could we throw one here if we go and move out of cover? No. Flashbangs have like no range at all. Let's see. Can't I not throw that far? Oh, I, it doesn't let me. Okay. No one is in here. We can now... We could... In uh, earlier versions of this game, climb through the window. Now we can simply take some shots and go back. Be the little scared cats that we are. We have a sniper on position, which could try, would probably miss and hit our own guy. So now we don't hit our guy and we have a low chance for it. There we go. We have someone who did nothing. You did nothing because you have... You are not near him. 30... Uh, 30. Wow. 42 units or... Yeah. Action points needed. I can't throw here. I have... Oh. Someone is in the way. Okay. Let's... Uh, let's... 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 Let's go here. There's no reason to wait there. He is suppressed, so he has only half points. Enough to take one or two shots. Wow, this is one of the slowest fights I have ever fought. I don't really know why. Because aliens normally have pretty big guns and mow down my guys. Right at the beginning. There we go. Another suppression flashbang. I cannot wait for stun grenades. Because this does not really help. He is full life. He can get another healing done. You can get your grenade. Uh, grenade, right. Your machine gun. You can still not throw because you suck. Could get a little bit further. Holy crap! How much strength do you have? Zero? Okay, throw here. There we go. You are more or less boned. But that is okay, right? How about you? You throw one here. There we go. New. Come on. There we go, unconscious. And they stay unconscious until the game, the scenario ends, I think. I cannot go through this window. Maybe because it is not big enough. We could go into cover here. We see someone down there. So we go into cover. Oh. Still. We can go into cover here. So, can you run all the way down here? No. You can though. I want to stay in good cover. You can go in here. There we go. Now, the thread on the left is for the, in the meantime, is uh, gone. So we can go a little bit Further, we can check here. It is pretty hard to advance towards the ship. So, we can run in here. We should be safe. We can simply... Hmm, I mean, we have these time units left. So, there's 
no reason to spare them. You can run in here. We can all run to the right. And leave him to explore to the left. Which is not all that far, only until here. Let's see what the alien is doing. We oh alien is moving closer. Now one big thing is looting. Let's loot. What do you have? Alien Metagy rifle plus ammunition. And the corpse. Interesting. I don't really need that. We have some civilian down here. We have an enemy down there, which is going to get shot. And we miss. Okay. Have you too. There we go. We don't have that much stuff to use. We could throw a grenade. Our grenades have like no cover. They, they are really, really bad, these grenades. Okay, nothing going on here. There we go. Near down. Get some extra cover. You can run up. Let's see if we find... There we go, we can now see the alien. Was this one at least? Mm, we know where this alien is now. We can go back. You down. Oh, I did. I did. A, this was a big mistake. Let's see. We can go out. Look into here. Throw the grenade right there. Bam. It's going to. Do a little bit of damage. Not much. I can't really throw there. I can, however. How many points? Mm, I can't really. Okay. Go back into cover. We can go up a little bit with him. Hopefully, this is covered. And he can. You see, there's no cover to the left. So this would be a really bad choice to move to. But we can always move to here. Sniper shot. We still have you. You can do stuff. We can simply throw a smoke right here. So he should not be able to shoot at us. Which gives us a little bit lenient area yeah do we have right those did not move they can move up here near down kneeling down is not always the best choice because we need three points to go up again so let's not near down they should be pretty safe grenade exploded he does have enough life god damn it my assault did take a lot of damage. We have a bunch of them there. Good. Now, looting. Ah, the uh, broken down and fleeing and right into the enemy. Fantastic. Now, we know there's an alien running around here. Which is not ideal. He's going to try and kill civilians. So, let's see. At least we have vision on him. We cannot really attack him because of all the smoke. Mm. Okay. What we can do is go in here. Near down. And pepper him. Now the chance is that I hit my assault guy. Which is not optimal. But I don't have much of a choice right now. Let's simply try. We have 38 points left. Get the tree a little bit down. Not much. 
Let's see if we can get some shots in. We can get another. And then we can go out of the way. The next one. Let's go. Get him. Maybe. Uh, or not. Go out of the way. We can then continue. Bam. Come on. There we go. He is dead. Now, do we have enough points to move all the way down here? No. Can We cannot move over fences. You are kidding me, right? We cannot move over fences. This is really bad. We cannot jump over fences. This is more or less really, really, a really good thing to jump over fences and or windows. It's really bad that we can't do that. Now we can run here. And there we go. And simply throw a smoke here. Hopefully that will keep my guy alive. For another round. They should have a higher miss chance. They still get some shots in. And I retaliate. And he is getting his shots in. Now the problem is... Uh, another... Oh, a lot of damage. The biggest problem is he has broken down and fled. So, he doesn't have his uh, weapon anymore. He is weaponless. Now you are not going to equip that. You are going to run as far as you can. Now, both of them are outside of the enemies. I cannot throw again. I can. I can only hit... Oh no, I can probably hit both of them. One grenade here, we do not... Oh, we have another grenade here. Eh. Which we will throw too. And... You see the rate is 8% chance to hit. Do we have another grenade? We do. How much points do you need? 40, uh, 34. Enough to move up and go down and throw another grenade. We are going to destroy him. Him and his friend. So we try to not lose any guys. I did want to throw my grenade. You did knew that, right? We move up. We throw our grenade. Where did he throw his grenade? Please don't tell me you missed and you threw the grenade to the ground. Everything but that, please. Would be not the first time for someone to fuck up. There we go. Getting some healing done. And turn. One, two, three, four. Good, both A and dead. Didn't move him, right. And something was on the left. Holy crap, hey! Hey, how are you? Let's, uh... Miss? Uh, miss? Okay. How about, how about you don't do that? It would be really nice. Now the problem is to reinforce him, because he's all alone. I don't really need the sniper here anymore, because even if there's an alien inside, I am not going to get a clean shot in. We are going to move you to this corpse, see what we have here. We have an alien flame cell and alien fl what? Alien flamer rifle, okay. I like the design of the weapons, they are really nice. They look really futuristic, really, really nice design. 
Let's go and get two guys behind our shield. Get you your weapon back. There we go. Get you some healing. Still. There we go. Here's the rest. You can first off retreat. Um, not this way. There we go. We need more more strength down here so you run all the way up here heavy machine gunner yeah not really as uh, that he can he can jump okay so the shit guy cannot jump okay i i see why he would not be able to jump over the fence he has a shield in the hand so yeah let's reload and move now let's keep you as backup you never know what is inside a ship. Uh, we moved more or less everyone. Let's end. Oh damn. He missed. He got one hit in. Interesting that the sound files are not really working, it seems. So we could run. All the way down here. We need some sort of shoot. There we go. We need uh, some way to retaliate to his aggression. We could get some shots in here. Uh, you can move up here. I don't think this is cover in any form. It is from one side. Okay. Good enough. Now, how many points do you need to throw this? Too many. How many points you need? You need 15 to go here. So you could get one shot in a normal snap. Which does a little bit of damage. There we go. And now we go with a little barrage, we get some damage in. Fantastic. Now we... He does, he did not lose that much life, which is good. Now we need to be careful of the smoke. It has some bad effects on my soldier's health. There seems to be no one in here. Good, we have captured the ship. We are going to position ourselves so we can defend. If people are going to attack, we have uh, one red guy outside somewhere running around. There we go, you can jump over the fence. There we go, we found the red guy. There we go. Now... Doo -doo -doo -doo. Let's go in here, we have some better cover and we don't run into the problem uh, with shooting at our own guys. Green is half cover and red is full cover. There we go, let's see what is he doing. He is running around, ah oh, damn. Not good. Okay, he did not commit. So, we are going to move one space. We are going to change into some healing. Because the longer you wait to heal yourself, back up, the more permanent damage you have. The, the, the gray bar is the temporary damage and it goes down every turn. So some, if you wait too long, you have permanent damage. Which means you have to wait in, in the medical center until you are fully healed or healed enough okay no hit no hit holy crap you are so bad there we go okay suppress your own guy and we got the alien dead mission accomplished on this side now that alien didn't want to move so we are going to check what is he up to? He is not there anymore. Interesting. 
He's not there. Now, which means I have the feeling he is trying to come around to get into the ship. Because the ship is more or less the main point of this mission. I don't know if there is still the thing that you have to capture the ship a uh, number of turns and then you automatically win. It was before, was one of the reason why I won some of the fights which I should not have won. Normally, at least. There we go. I run a position. Let's see, where's the red guy? Still not somewhere visible. Let's hear. Full health. At least as much as we can get. Reload. Go a little bit exploring. There we go, sniper. First off, we get the heavy guy in here. Sniper can move all the way up here. I would think the enemy is to the right, not to the left. So we will check in a moment. We got everything covered down here. Now we can go up here. Nothing visible. Let's check around here. Do we see something? Huh. Nothing visible. If we move around here. There we are. Red guy sighted. Now we see another guy somewhere. We have uh, inside the house is someone. Good, you are going to move up to this area. We know where the red guy is now. What we can do, uh, because running out there is get is putting our soldiers at risk, we can throw a flashbang right there. Get him suppressed. He has only half his movement points. Or action points, which means he is not going to be as effective as he would otherwise be. We can then go into. Uh, we could check. Can we walk around? I have no idea where I'm walking here. Is there something on the ground here? There is. We have a and flames and an a and flamer pistol. Which probably mm, does instant diary damage. So there was another entrance, which I should have checked at the beginning. So he can attack the shield. The shield still is up. So we are going to block all damage. As long as we have that. Now, we definitely want to check if someone is down here. We don't want to be surprised. By some backstabs. Go backstabbing going on here. You need to check the body. We have one iron grenade which we will use. There we go. Would be nice if there was a stun grenade here, but okay. I am taking the grenade either way. Grenades are pretty good. Uh, the sniper will move up here. It is more beneficial. So if he, if the sniper is here, he can cover both sides instead of only one. And here we have our shotgun on the way and bam, we miss once, we miss two times. Okay. We can move our, mm, that, that was stupid. Move you back. With you here. Uh, 22 points. Bam. We got one hit in. Fantastic. We now can change into our pistol and can take a shot. 
some pot shots. He is suppressed. Good enough. Now we can move up here and do a little bit of backstabbing ourselves and then move back. And you are going to move up here. There we go. We are checking the left side. Nothing to see. You are going to support your guy at the front. We are going to check here. Nothing to see. You wait here. Let's see what is the, the answer. Oh, he runs into our direction. Has broken his, and is fleeing. Nothing happened to you. Nothing. You simply broke down and fled. Where are you? There you are. Bam. In the face. Bam. In the face. For more damage. And we are in a really peculiar situation. No, 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 no. Can you move up here? No. You can't move here. Mm. Okay. We got two shots in. Which we can move up here. Which is not really the best choice. You can kill him. There we go. He's dead. It's interesting. He can move to the spot, but I can't. There we go. Do we have stuff on the ground? We do not. We definitely know there's someone in there, so we are going to smoke in this direction. I'm trying to use everything I have available to me. And smokes are pretty useful. They are n they give a pretty big penalty, hit penalty for everyone that tries to hit through a smoke. Let's move up all our soldiers. We need them at the front. Here we go. We need the sniper at a really good position here. Smoke is not really helping us that much here. There we go. We get our shit guy at the front. He's somewhere in the house or at, at the outside. Hit movement. I don't know. Where is he? There he is. Can we hit him? No. Now we could... We could throw some grenades and destroy his cover. One grenade here. You can move up. You don't have any grenades. You have this one. Can't really throw inside. With that hit him. Let's try. Okay, suppressed. Good enough. So is the smoke still damaging or stuff? So he cannot go over the wall. But he can be simply standing there. There we go. And you can move up here. Everyone is in position. Suppressed again. And Okay, good thing you didn't hit your own guy. I heard sniper shots are really bad for your health. There we go. Let's try again. And we got a hit. He's dead. And we won. Okay. What did we get? We get a light scout, data core, alien alloy, civilian guard corpse, civilian non-combatant, which we... Uh, yeah, which we gave a concussion. So being specialist corps, so we got some alien blood pistol, flamer pistol, flamer rifle, metal G assault, metal G rifle. We get some blood grenades, we get some rifles. 
we get zero dollar. Zero. We get nothing? Maybe next time when we don't need all that stuff to uh, send to research. We got some points, no one level no one got a promotion. Pretty okay mission. Let's go to the research center. Holy crap, we have a lot to research. Okay, A and alloys is uh, is the same probably. A and fugitive found. We find a season out of the UFO we encountered. He wants to talk with you, Commander. An interrogation study, study of our alien captive. We believe this could allow us to develop a method of communication. And Sabine analyzes and analyzes. Okay. And then we have all this, which we cannot do for whatever reason. But okay. Uh, doo -doo -doo. I think we will see next time what we do. And yeah. And we will end this episode here. So don't forget to subscribe, share, like and comment. And as always, thank you for watching. And I will see you next time.